a Western Conference rival. The Golden State Warriors are ready for this thing to get started. Happy holidays, everyone, from all of us at 2K Sports. And do we have a present for you today? For Steve Kerr and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan. Welcome to NBA Basketball. Earlier in the season, the Golden State Warriors ended up losing their last game in this matchup against the Lakers. And so, with that loss, that gives each team one win apiece in this series. Both teams want this one badly. Yeah, I thought their defense in that game was about as shaky as it could be. At home, you know, that kind of defense isn't going to cut it. Never mind if you're on the road. They really look tired to me, and I don't know if they had travel issues or if they were out too late, but something was amiss because they had no energy. Now, Golden State's starting five. Thompson and Barnes, the two and three. Azealia is out there with David Lee, and it's Curry in at the one spot. Shots good from Mr. Fundamentals. Strong move to the hoop. Nice power move. I like that one. Looking at the last game for the Golden State Warriors, it was a win against the Kings. I thought the way they attacked the rim and got into the paint was phenomenal. It seemed like after a while, the defense just kind of waved the white flag. That's exactly what will happen when a team continues to attack the goal and come away with layup. It demoralizes the defense. Four on the clock. Here's Curry with the three. No good. And the Lakers will go the other way with it. Mr. Fundamentals passes to Bryant. No good off the front iron. Most of the time, that shot will go down. Boy, the defenders have to make sure they tag him. Thompson outside. Outside Curry. From the arc. That's good. Curry's got eight points. There's a chance he could have a big game if they don't DM up more tightly on the perimeter. Here's Mr. Fundamentals, guarded by Curry. Got a piece of it. Here's Mr. Fundamentals, and misses it off the right side of the rim. The Warriors have gone three of four from the field to start out the game. Pass to Lee. Barnes kicks to Lee. And he banks in the lane. Lee's got his first points of the night. It seems that every pass they make is leading to a score here. I mean, that's just exquisite ball movement. Yeah, they're making the right play. They're working together, and they're just looking for the best shot they can every possession. Randall with the bucket. He can finish in the post. That's one thing we know about him. Here's Curry. 17 points for him last game against Sacramento. But Kevin, his passing is what blew me away. I mean, to see him orchestrate their offense so impeccably, that was a sight to behold. Now here's Lee. A shot by Thompson, and no one's around. No good on the three. He lobs it up, and Young with the stuff. That's the epitome of teamwork right there, Kevin, on the alley-oop. Clark, what about the finish bringing it down with some thunder? Yeah, lightning, but... too. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll tell you, the pass was even better. I mean, he put it on an absolute platter for him. Curry kicks to Azili. Back to Curry. Lets it go with a three. And he gets it to go. Curry's got 11 points. And as hot as he's been this quarter, the game plan should be simple. Get him the ball and get out of the way. Here's Mr. Fundamentals, guarded by Curry. Here's Mr. Fundamentals. And the shot is good, hopping in off the front of the rim. Just over three and a half minutes gone here in the first. Curry dishes to Azili. Golden State moving it around. Here's Barnes. Shakes off the strong D and gets to the bucket for two. You know, there's no better sign of how efficiently a team is operating than their assist numbers. And theirs are fantastic. It's just beautiful basketball to watch, Clark. Howard. And there's two points. Working on the glass, paying off that time. Howard's got his first basket. You know, that's been a big part of their offense in the early stages. I mean, their success working the ball inside and getting points from close range right at the rim. And I would continue to do it. You know, force the defense to maybe send a double team. Now you've got other options to work with offensively. And here is Los Angeles now after the miss from Stephen Curry. Howard, the pass to Mr. Fundamentals. Puts it up from 15. And off the front. And in it goes. Mr. Fundamentals got six points. That mid-range jumper, just another one of his weapons. 
outside Curry. And he uses the glass on the layup. He's looking pretty confident out there. I mean, five of seven so far from the field. He's feeling it. Lakers trail by five. Here's Mr. Fundamentals. 14 points from him the last game against the Kings in Sacramento. Boy, we don't see that too often. No defender on him, and he just clanks the open jumper. Now here's Curry. Feeds it to Barnes. This one for three. Good, and Curry gets the assist. Barnes has got his second bucket of the night. Boy, they've settled into their offense very quickly here today. Yeah, they're zoned in, making the most out of their possessions here. Here's Mr. Fundamentals. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. Yeah, the referee's all over that one. No doubt about it. Clearly a foul. Nothing to argue about there. And let's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for the Warriors. Well, they've definitely had the hot hand from the three-point line so far. Always nice to start out like that. Something else they've been able to do so far tonight is earn those tough points in the paint. Now here's Curry. 13 points in the game. The dish to Thompson. Back to Curry. Great pass to set up the lay-in. Curry's got 15 points. You know, it's really hard not to notice the difference in the passing of these two teams today. Yeah, look at the discrepancy in this, the assist call between these two teams. Things have kind of gone south for them here in the quarter. Here's Thompson. And another basket for Golden State. Mm, their offense has really come together immediately, threatening to run away with this game. It's hard to imagine they'll be able to stay as hot as they've been so far, but if they can, watch out. Now the shooting guards you see listed there have been the ultra-reliable players for the past month. Take a look at their percentages from the field at that time. Number one, Kobe Bryant. Now he's not a wasteful player. I mean, that much we've learned. He makes the most of the good looks he gets. And if it's not there, he, he's not going to force a bad shot. But you know what, Steve? It's not all about shot selection. Let's not overlook what an unbelievable shooter he is, period. I mean, he can knock him down from all over the court with defenders draped all over him. The Lakers have converted one or two free throws so far today. Well, impressive free throw shooting as a team this season, uh, right around that 78% that mark. You know, their percentage has dropped off just a little bit compared to last year, guys, but it's not a huge drop-off, so no major concern. And the Warriors making a change here. Della Vidova's checked in. Here's Della Vidova. Back to Thompson. Kobe with the steal. Got a piece of it. Stolen by Thompson. The 10-footer. That one a little long. Lakers trail by 10. And here's the fast break. Kobe Bryant leading the way. One-on-one -on -one fast break. The Lakers with the rebound. Howard's got his third rebound on the night. Down low. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. And the offense is getting right to the rim, but at least they saved the layup with the foul. That's old-school basketball rules. I mean, at the end of the day, no easy layup. Turn it from the line. Los Angeles shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. And he can't get the first one. And the Warriors making a change here. Iguodala's checked in. Good on the second free throw. Here's Della Vidova. And I think Doris Burke has something for us right now. Doris? Hey, Kevin, thanks. Golden State's head coach and I were able to chat. Obviously, he has a lot on his plate when it comes to defending against Kobe Bryant. I asked him what he might do, and he said, not much. He's one of the league's all-time best scorers. And no matter what you seem to do, he finds ways to get on the scoreboard. Kobe might be seeing a lot of double teams here tonight, guys. Thanks again, Doris. Boy, what a fantastic opening quarter for them. Yeah, it sure has been. Look at the lead they've jumped out to already. Impressive. Here's Mr. Fundamentals. He's got eight. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. Been a real difficult game for him offensively, and it's costly. Thompson, and there's the call on Clay Thompson. That's foul number two for him. Great defense. He anticipated the play and got there first. Yeah, I think he got there in time. Nice play. So both teams making some changes here. Here's Mr. Fundamentals, and he gets it to go. 
Mr. Fundamentals got 10 points. What a quarter for him at the offensive end. He's ignored the scoreboard and continued to go out there and do his thing. Here's Miritich. They get it back. Misses from close range. Had a pretty good look at the basket, but defensively they did a nice job rotating, forcing the miss. Young with no one around. Here's Jinx. Miracic grabs the miss. Warriors leading by nine. Williams kicks to Delvadova. Dishes to Miritich. At the elbow, Williams. And he jams it with authority. That could give him a huge injection of energy club. And Kevin, that's exactly what they need right now. They've got to close the gap. Forget about that for a second. How about the burst to the bucket for a point guard? Boy, he can power those down. Now here's Williams. He had 16 points in the win against Sacramento. He did a great job picking the defense apart, too. It wasn't just his scoring. Give him credit for his passing in that game, too. Boy, where was the box out? Too easy on that second chance opportunity. Yeah, no box out is what happened there. Those kind of mistakes on the glass will kill a team. Not that bucket in in no time at all. 14 points for Mr. Fundamentals. Man, he has been their unquestioned leader offensively this quarter. Outside, Williams. Knocked loose. And the whistle blows on the backcourt violation. He went over and back. Now a chance to check out Nick Young here. Some good work from him over the last 10 games. First in three-point shooting. And his field goal percentage has been off the charts. He's in the top five in the NBA in terms of shooting accuracy. Well, Steve, I mean, I've got to say one more thing about his league best three-point percentage. It kind of reminds me of you, partner. Not rushing shots, doing the same thing every time, and not settling for bad ones. Only taking good shots and then making the most of it. Outside, Williams. Pass to Barnes. Golden State moving the ball around. Here's the break. It's Mo Williams with the rebound. Oh, perfect opportunity to finish the break, and he blows it. Steve, you have to be able to finish off plays like that. It's a must. Barnes can't get it to go. That was a good rebound right there, but they haven't been very strong on the glass so far. Well, they've got to meet the energy that they're facing right now. So important to battle on the board. A shot's good from Mr. Fundamentals. You know, something we're seeing less and less of these days, that little finger roll. Guys, on all missed shots, we have to rebound first, and then we have to run. Fill the lane, sprint the floor, and let's attack the rim before they can set their defense. It's all about scoring in transition. Jeremy Lin, he's checked in for Los Angeles. Now we get a chance to check out the standings out west. Already we're in December. We'll take a look at the Warriors. They're in the middle at fifth in the conference, looking to build in the wins as the season goes on. They're at the 10th position. You know, for the Warriors, they've got to be happy with how things have gone for them. I mean, they haven't suffered a deep drop-off, and they're still the good, solid team they were a year ago. Yeah, but they haven't taken a step forward either. And I thought maybe they would. I mean, to me, this has been a little bit disappointing. They're not in bad position. I just thought they'd be better, Clark. Boy, stone cold at the free throw line so far. They've been awful. Yeah, and they can ill afford to give all those points away from the strike. Lakers trail by six. Here's Mr. Fundamentals. It's good. Only a few seconds into the shot clock. Mr. Fundamentals got 18 points. Clark, the coach, was really passionate in that last title, trying to do everything he can to get his message across. You know, and I'm not sure what he wanted exactly, but he did it with enough fire that I'm guessing he's not going to be happy with any lapse in execution. I mean, he made his point pretty clear. So it's the Lakers now. Mo Williams unable to get his shot to go. And the rejection by Igudala. Bill trying to break free. Last game for the Lakers, it was a loss to the Kings. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. The Warriors shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Well, impressive free throw shooting as a team this season, uh, right around that 78% that mark. And comparing to the numbers of last season, they've made a bit of improvement, so that's some positive momentum they can look to build on. Here's Mr. Fundamentals. He's got 18. Unloads from 13. Pull the shot.